What's going on guys, Shinko101 here, uh, and I'm going to do another review analysis of another match. Uh, somebody told me to re you know, review his match. Um, I just see the one match here, so I guess I'll go ahead and do that. So yeah, without further ado, here we go. Make sure I got input on, and yeah. Hopefully we can learn learn a thing or two with this. So yeah, Ken is, Ken is probably the best character in the game as of right now, until they decide to nerf him or buff other characters. But I strongly feel he is just ridiculously good. Okay. So, um, right there, uh, you jumped. <laughs> let's, let's pause for a second. Right then and there, you jump. You never really want to start off immediately with the jump. You kind of want to just hang back, right? You know, hang back and get a feel of your opponent. And uh, jumping with Manan is also scary. I guess it showed a, per, a character like Ryu or Ken because they, or Luke because they get this uppercut. So you kind of want to, with Manan... This matchup, you kind of want to just slow and steady work your way and kind of walk him down the corner, right? So right there, right there, you know, he just kind of goes into you with the random, what I call the online random Ken BS, where they just kind of go crazy and try to get you flustered, right? Okay, good drive reversal, good sweep, good command grab. Now, right here, you're building up medals, obviously, with each command grab. Every command grab you get, you get, you get stronger medals, right? So, uh, Ken, a lot of Shotos, like Ryu and Ken, uh, know, to, know that they're going to be they're gonna be jumping a lot because they don't want to get command grab. They don't want to give you a medal, right? Right there, EXDP, so you should punish that. Mm, you could have punished harder with a, one of your fierce normals. And also, you could have punished with one of your, uh, with your meter. Canceling your meter combo into another combo is uh, what you want to do. But okay, you get the command grab. Should, you shouldn't really be jumping. You're, you're winning right here. So at this point, you just kind of have to wait. Ah, uh, see? The Ken was either going to uppercut and uh, or, or EX uppercut, right? That's what, they, that's what they usually go for. Okay, you're still in a good position. Here, you should have anti-air. When he jumped on you, you should have done the, the little down, I think the down hard punch anti-air. Okay, he's burnt out, so you, you could pretty much win this with a checkmate. Okay, just hold that lead. There you go. Okay, command grab. Right here, he's going to do a good chunk of damage, so you should honestly just wait. Because he's probably going to uppercut or do something random. you got 68 seconds on the clock. You're winning. You don't really need to go in and do anything too crazy. That's negative. Oh, he punishes that with a sweep. We get dry reversal. You don't need to do that. Just need to wait. Yeah, you try drive... Uh, drive impact out of, you know, scramble, and you eat a counter throw. Yeah, I, and I know it's kind of hard to deal with because with the way cannon, online cans jump around all over the place, it can be a little annoying to deal with, but you kind of just have to wait. Let them hang themselves. Let them do EX uppercut or unsafe stuff and just punish. Yeah, it shouldn't be jumping in. Honestly, you just, you just, you just gotta wait and, and do down back. They jump in on you, just anti-air. Jinrai is also really annoying to deal with. Maybe drive uh, drive reversal or drive impact. And yeah, now he's just going in. He's feeling himself because he won the last round. He's jumping all over the place. Okay, command grab. Uh -huh. I don't think you should have woke up with EX or uh, drive parry because look how far away you are. Maybe you're trying to do a drive rush or drive dash. There, you should have anti-aired. He goes in for throw. See, you gotta, you gotta anti-air with him. Spence for level two. When they jump in on you with Manon, you gotta be ready to do either. I want to say it's either crouching medium punch or crouching hard punch. The anti-air where she's like pointing up, you know. There, you can absorb that with drive uh, with the blue stuff. Uh, 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 parry. Yeah, and that's it. So the biggest thing you want to kind of just do is just if they jump in on you, anti-air, right? If and then when you knock them down, they're going to go for EX Uppercut, right? So actually, if I can pull this up really quick, and uh, I'll end it right there. Uh, I actually have notes that I keep on my little, my own little personal thing uh, when I fight uh, other characters. Let me see if I can pull that up. And uh, you see, match up, my matchup uh, notes. I keep this for myself against every character, and it kind of helps me. So right here, uh, well, that might be too advanced. But anyways, yeah, Ken play. You want to keep notes of what Ken typical Kens do. And typical Kens, they pretty much are gonna go for EX uppercut on wake up, and you just gotta learn an anti air. So, anyways, I hope that helps. GG.